To introduce the change of base formula, I want to provide some motivation for looking at logarithms of numbers that don't nicely um, become powers of our base. So here we have an example, log base 2 of 19. So there is no whole number power of 2 that will give us 19. So what we want to try to do is understand the value of that number, log base 2 of 19, by comparing it to a couple of logarithms that we do know. So I know that 16 is a power of 2, and log base 2 of 16 is less than log base 2 of 19. The next whole number of power of 2 is log base 2 of 32, or I should say 32 is the next whole number power of 2. So log base 2 of 32 is greater than log base 2 of 19, and it's the next nice logarithm that I can actually obtain a value for that's a nice number. So log base 2 of 16, 2 to the fourth power is 16, so that's our whole number there. Log base 2 of 32, 2 to the fifth is 32. So log base 2 of 19 is somewhere between 4 and 5, and I would estimate it's a little bit closer to 4 since 19 is closer to 16. Let's see now, now that we have a good estimate, let's see if we can use our calculator to help us find a better approximation. So if we're going to enter this into our calculator, log base 2 of 19, I can't use the keys that I'm familiar with, mainly the log button, because log is base 10. Log base 2, there's no way to enter that onto the calculator, but we're going to use the following formula, log base 2 of 19 equals log of 19 divided by log of 2 and if we enter that into our calculator we should get approximately 4.248 now practice this because there are some places you can go wrong your calculator will give you a left paren you need to close the right paren around a 19 before you put in the division then the same thing around the 2, your calculator will probably give you the left parenthesis. You're going to need to con, um, complete the right before you hit enter. So make sure that you can perform this computation on your calculator. Now the question is, do we believe this is a good approximation? And if so, how would we check? Well remember, logarithm is an exponent. So if 4.248 is log base 2 of 19, then when I raise 2, to the 4.248 power, I should get approximately 19. And in fact, if I raise 2 to the 4.248 power, I get a number very, very close to 19. So our estimation is good, and we can say log base 2 of 19 equals 4.248. So what we did again was we used a formula, which you'll see further down the page, called the change of base formula. So we took the log of 19 divided by the log of the base, and that gave us a very good approximation for log base 2 of 19. Turns out you can do this with any logarithm of any base.